what is two factor authentication a two factor authentication or 2fa is an extra layer of security most people on any application we use only single layer that is our password but to protect our account we can implement our two factor authentication we can see more details from the google websites on 2fa for example if you are using only single layer and if our password is hacked but even if our password is hacked but the person who knows the password he will still need our phone or a security key to get into our account if you are if you have implemented a two step verification a sign in will always required something which we know and something we have for example we know our password but along with password if you implement two step authentication then we also required a phone on which either we can get a push notification we can get a sms with a text or we can use the authenticator number so using two steps authentication we can secure our account details for example from the google how it works if you implement a two step verification into google and we we are trying to sign in into the account it was little differently first we need to enter our password on the login screen and after that as soon as we click on the next button after enter the password most of the time first we get a push notification on our registered device and if we click on yes on our registered device then we will able to log into the account or there are many other options like we can get a text or we can use the google authenticator to log in into gmail account similar concept is available on many other platforms where we can use the similar concept so what are common types of two factor authentication there are different types of 2fa available like the hardware tokens this is very old very rarely used nowadays and the common types are like sms text and voice based two factor authentication second some use the biometric authentication push notification which we can see in the gmail or if you're using the amazon application and if you're trying to sign in from some other device then on your original registered device you will get push notification to approve that sign in but among all these the very popular is the software token for 2fa the software token 2fa is very popular and the preferred method among all the remaining types of 2fa this call as the software generated time based one time passcode that is totp first we need to install free 2fa app on our smartphone or desktop for example we can use the google authenticator and then they can use the app with any site that support this type of authentication at the sign in first user enter the username and password and then when prompted they enter the code shown on the app so this is the two factor authentication so for all projects my approach will be i am going to use the google authenticator on which we can see a time based otp so what is time based otp this number which is generated it is stay along for 30 seconds and after every 30 second this gets changed okay and to and to add our application we can add a new secret key suppose take an example you are using google authenticator for 20 different sites so for every sites there will be new secret key and suppose if we implement this into sap then first from this rapid api we will generate a secret key and that secret key we can add by clicking on this plus sign either we can add the secret key manually or we can scan the qr code and the only that particular secret id numbers we have to use in our authentication process so here i am going to use google authenticator as a 2fa and for api i will be using the rapid api which we can access from this given link here the use of api like 
generating the secret key for SAP user. Take an example, if we have 10 SAP user, which we want to implement 2FA, then for 10 users, we need to generate the secret key using the rapid API. And then we need to enroll this using Google Authenticator by scanning the QR code or by manually maintaining the secret key. After doing this, the third will be that is validation of the TOTP from the Google Authenticator. This all will do by using the Rapid API. Now, what are other options that are available other than Rapid API? There are many more companies available. Take an example, you can go to twilio.com, the OT API and Authenticator API and there are many more websites available. But as I already used the Rapid API in my actual projects, so I'm going to give a demo on using Google Authenticator along with the Rapid API.